Hi, my name is Miguel from avoiderrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to convert a physical computer into a virtual machine. To do this, we're going to need VMware Workstation. The link is in the description box below. This program is not free, but you can use the 30-day free trial period that they have. Once you have downloaded and installed VMware Workstation, double-click to run. When it opens, click on File. From the drop-down, click on Virtualize a Physical Machine. When you click on Virtualize a Physical Machine, it's going to install a program called VMware vCenter Converter that works in conjunction with VMware Workstation. Once VMware vCenter Converter is installed, click on Virtualize a Physical Machine. Here, click Next to the wizard. Now it's asking for the host name or IP address of the physical machine. I'm going to create a virtual machine out of this computer. So I'm going to type the IP address of this computer. To find out the IP address of your computer, press the Windows key plus R on your keyboard. Then the Run window will open. Here, type CMD and press OK, just like you see here. This will open the command prompt. Here, type IP config and press Enter. This here is your IP address. Now type this IP address here. You can also type the host name, but I prefer the IP address. Perfect. Now we need an administrator, username, and password. Remember, you must have administrative privileges or have full administrative rights to do this. To find out if you're an administrator or who is an administrator in Windows, click on Start, then click on Control Panel, then click on User Accounts. In Windows XP, it should show you right there. In Windows 7, you have to click on Manage Another Account, and here it will tell you if you are an administrator or who is an administrator on the computer. In this case, it's Windows 7, the administrator, so I'm going to use this account. So under username, type the administrator name. And then type the password for that user. Perfect. Remember, you need administrative privileges to do this. And click Next. Here, name your virtual machine. I'm going to leave it as is Windows 7. And then select the path of the virtual machine. You can leave it default or you can browse for a different location. I have already created a folder for this virtual machine, so I'm going to browse for my folder. I'm going to select Drive F under VMware folder and then click OK. Once you have selected the path, then click on Next. Here, type the username for the local account. Since I'm going to create a virtual machine out of this computer, I'm going to use this computer username and password and click Finish. If I was creating a virtual machine out of a PC in the network, then I will use the username and password of the computer where I'm running VMware Workstation. If you're converting your own PC, then use your own username and password. Once it's done creating the virtual machine, on the left pane here, click on the Windows 7, the name of the virtual machine. Click on the play symbol to start your newly created uh, virtual machine. Type the password for the user. And perfect, you have successfully created a virtual machine out of a physical computer. 
thank you for watching this video my name is Miguel if you have any questions please feel free to post them in the comment section below thank you